today we are going to see another method of drawing polygon that method we can call it as alternate method for drawing any polygon yesterday we have seen the general method and today we are going to see the alternate method so the first draw a line of the given side suppose here we will draw a line of atmm this is the line ab now we will draw perpendicular bisector of this line ab so here what we will do we will put compass on point a and we will take distance in compass more than half and then we will mark one r the top and again at the bottom without changing distance we will mark the another arc which will cut to the initial arc so here not meeting we will again redraw it now we will join this line so here we have drawn the perpendicular bisector to this line ab now we will put this compass at point b here we will take ab as a radius in the compass and then we will draw one arc which it will cut to the perpendicular bisector so here we got the perpendicular bisector and this arc they will meet here and that will mark this is one point that is point number 6 then again we will consider this point as a O here we got on point now we will put compass at point O and we will take radius as O2 K and then we will draw one semicircle and this the semicircle which it cuts to the perpendicular bisector that we will mark as a point number 4 so here we got point 4 and here we got point 6 now here we will extend this perpendicular bisector line slightly okay so we extended this perpendicular bisector line so here we got point number 4 and point number 6 on this perpendicular bisector now here what we will do we will divide this line that is from 4 to 6 this is the line and that we will divide here so again we will take distance more than half here and we will draw one arc this is one arc similarly on other side also we will draw an arc now we will put on point number 6 and then we will draw another arc here here now we will draw a line passing through these two points right so now here what we did i will just zoom here so this 4 to 6 that we have divided and here i got one point that is point number 5 so here point number 4 this is point number 5 and this is 
point number six. Okay, so here we will try to draw the hexagon. So in the last problem we have seen five as a center, and based on that we have drawn the pentagon. Now we will take six as a center so that we can draw hexagon. Now I will put this compass at point number six, and then we will take radius as six to a. We'll check, yes, it is correct. Now we take six to a as a radius, and we will draw one circle. Okay. So this is we got the circle. Now next, what we will do? We will take a to b distance in compass, and I will put at point number b, and we will mark the arcs on this circle. This is. An arc I got again. I will put at point number A. Left hand side here, we will get another arc. In this way, we will mark the different arcs on this circle. Okay. So now here we mark all the point. So that we will number now. This is point A, B, and this is the next point C. This is D, E, and E R. So here, one of the side of the polygon A B already there. Now we'll join all these different corresponding point. Now we'll join this B to C, then C to D. Next. D to E, then E to F, then F to A. So this is how we have drawn the hexagon by using alternate method. Thank you, everyone.